I'm Helen Wright and I'm here at the Conexpo show in Las Vegas. I've caught up with Arvid Ronaldo. He's the Marketing Communications Director of Volvo Construction Equipment. We're going to talk about the new engines that Volvo has brought out to meet the stricter emissions regulations that came in at the start of the year. So, Arvid, can you explain the technology that Volvo has used to meet the new regulations? Well, technologies is very interesting, and first of all, this, this is a great challenge for the industry. Uh, but actually, we at Volvo see it as an opportunity to deliver on our core values, quality, environmental care, and safety. So, especially then with environmental care, this will bring out less pollution to the society. So we're really looking forward to helping the industry with this. When it comes to the solutions available, we have a great toolbox within the Volvo company with lots of innovations and a lot of industry knowledge, like expertise. So we really think that we can pick the best possible solution to fit into the off-road application. And what we saw that being was an external uh, exhaust gas recirculation to take down NOx. And then we have a variable geometry turbo that also helps to create this balance in the engine. And then as an after-treatment system to trap the particles, we use a diesel particle filter with an active burner that helps to, to make it very effective with always full power available. Has this new technology affected the size of the engines at all? Well, this is a multi-task question, but when it comes to, to the actual sizing of the, the components and everything, of course it will take some more space, but we're trying to really integrate it as good as we can. And since we have the, the knowledge within the company and we are engineering both the engine and we have the group competence of the after treatment system, we really have a unique position to be able to make it as effective as possible, the integration in the actual machine. But yes, it takes some more space. When it comes to, to that as well, we're really proud that today here at the stand we have uh, three products that are already on the market, they just come from the factory, They're, you can buy one anytime you want. This is an, an articulator hauler, and you can see the installation in that one. You have an excavator, also on the stand, and you can see the installation in that one as well. And you have our flagship of this show, our brand new L250G. It's a brand new size class, which shows that we listen to our customer and create new sizes that customer needs. And also there you can see the installation, how nice it looks. So we're really proud to be able to be able to deliver. When the legislation kicks in, we're ready. We're proud of that. And how about servicing these new engines? Uh, what are the requirements for the diesel particulate filters, for example? And again, very good question. I've been working here at the stand, and that's actually one of the most common questions customers are asking me. Okay, but what's the service impacts of this new technology? And again, here we're, we're really been working extremely hard, and really with the skill sets of our engineers back home from the whole of Volvo Group, we managed to do a solution that you don't need to basically service until after 4,500 hours. Oh, basically you change the diesel particle filter and again we have a great solution there together with other trucks brands within the group so we have a great exchange program so you actually just call your dealership they come out and they change the filter within one hour for a very very low cost so it's a as far as the customer are responding they feel very confident and they they really like that answer 4500 hours other than that you just drive and it's full power always available. It's a very simple answer to give them. And of course there's the question of price as well. Can you give us an idea of, of whether they're going to be more expensive? I mean, we all want to help uh, society and we all want to contribute to having a cleaner environment around us. And we, as Volvo, has that as one of our core values. So, I mean, it's a great thing. And I think we all should think about that. But of course it takes advanced technology and it will cost you a little bit more. That's absolutely true. But again, we've been managing to install new engine platforms, a variable turbo, and other great features on the machine, like the 250, the, the OptiShift system. So we managed to actually lower fuel consumption by up to 15% in certain applications with this new Tier 4i Stage 3B technology. 
So again, we try to do the best for our customers and help them to make money and at the same time save the environment. Tell us a bit more about this 15% fuel efficiency saving. Yes, that's on our wheel orders, one of our greatest examples. We have the installed the new engine technology and together with that we have continued to also optimize other parts of the machine like the hydraulics, um, a new, a new uh, set linkage bar and most of all the new OptiShift system. It's a, it's a great system that helps the machine to, to change direction and make a, a smoother transaction when it's gearing. So it makes it much more efficient. So the engine, other new great features manage us to give the customer up to 15% fuel savings. So it's not, it's not only the engine, it's many things in the complete machine. But if you look at other machine types, it's also very much dependent on what application you're running in and if it's a articulator hauler, if an excavator, so it differs from the product. But the greatest example is the L2250 and load and carry applications. There we managed to do 15%. And of course, uh, these regulations are coming in stages and by 2014, you'll have to do the whole exercise again and meet the tier four final regulations. What's Volvo doing to, to, to meet that challenge? First of all, again, we see a great opportunity to bring all our knowledge together and deliver something great to, to, to the industry. Um, we have a great toolbox to pick from. Um, we're already having that technology available on the on-road side. They're rolling miles after miles and they're just testing it for us. And we within the group and in Volvo Construction Equipment will take the best possible solution and we're 100% sure that we will make it happen in a profitable way for the customer. Arvid, thank you very much for your time. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Sure, it was my pleasure. Glad to, to talk to you again. Thanks.